Here's how to simplify the discussion post edit screen for students. Copy the username from the data sheet or just have the username ready. Go to Users and paste the username in the Search Users box and hit the button. When the user comes up, control click or right click on the Switch To button under the username. This opens a new tab with the user's account. Go to that tab and hover over Create, then click on Discussion Post. Another tab will open. This is the screen we are simplifying. Close the Welcome to the Block Editor dialog. I recommend that you study this later. On this screen, click the three vertical dots for options in the top right corner. Scroll to the bottom of this panel and click Preferences. Note there are three tabs to the left of the pop-up screen that appears. You will make changes in all three. In general appearance, click two things on. Reduce the interface and spotlight mode. In blocks, turn on the two options under block interactions. In panels, turn everything off except for three options at the top and one in the bottom section. Leave on categories, tags, featured image on the top and just checklist on the bottom. Everything else should be turned off. Be sure to scroll to the bottom to get everything off except the four listed above. Then close the dialog box by clicking the X in the top right corner. Click the three vertical dots options button again to see that you only have just five panels. Status and visibility, categories, tags, featured image, and checklist. You can minimize status and visibility. You are done. If you are doing multiple students, here are the next steps in your workflow. Close the tab you are on. This will take you to the last open tab. Switch back to your account in the upper right corner. Then close this tab too. Go to the tab with the data sheet and check off the student you just completed. Then copy the next username and start again.